guys. So I just woke up not that long ago. Well, about an hour ago, but I haven't like I haven't woken up. I'm awake, but not really. So hold on. Peanut. No matter where you sign in, it always says Indiana, and I don't know why. So, today is Monday, December 11th, and we're just going to do a day in my life. I know that's what we did yesterday, but like, you know. So, uh, I just, and I, I honestly just looked at my calendar and like realized that we're doing a day in my life today. So I didn't film like making the bed, getting dressed, taking the dog for a walk. I didn't film any of that. So I just sat down on my computer, found out that's what we're doing today. My cats are running amok. Um, but yeah, so that's what we're doing today. Um, I am going to make pizza for breakfast. It's like 10 a.m. I woke up at like 8.30 maybe and laid in bed for a few minutes. Got up, did all the stuff. Um, I'm going to like put some makeup on. And today's going to be pretty boring because again, I'm still just getting ready for Christmas. So painting, we got paint. I got to finish painting the loft cleaning, organizing, putting everything together. I need to start a load of laundry, get the sheets on the guest bed. I need to do the sheets on the other guest bed. I need to vacuum. Josh already started the baseboards upstairs. So we need to finish that. Um, there's just a lot to do. I think we're gonna seal the back porch um, also before Christmas. So that means I need to remove everything from the back porch and take care of that. I, and <clears throat> it's really cold outside today, which is so nice. I'm so happy. It starts to feel like Christmas a week from today. I start my new job, so I'm so excited about that. But today's just going to be pretty chill. It's just going to be a lot of video-wise. It's going to be pretty chill. It's just going to be a lot of me running around my house and putting... I've been trying to get everything together before Christmas. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I do have to pop upstairs again um, and do some stuff. Then I'll come down here, make coffee, make breakfast, and get started on the day. I'm so not interested in doing anything except going back to sleep. I got a planner last night. Um, I ordered it from Amazon, so it came last night, and I only have through oh, January filled out, but it's just going to be, this planner is just going to be like my filming schedule for next year for TikTok and YouTube, and then my posting schedule for Instagram as well. So that's kind of what it's going to be. I don't have anything crazy in there yet. Just like what I'm filming, when I'm filming it, um, and then what I'm uploading as well. I have it on my digital calendar, but I like to write things down too. Um, but yeah, so when my highlighters come today, I think they're coming today, I'll be able to, and I already made a mistake and that is so freaking annoying. I, oh, I hate that. Cause then I just have to like squiggle it out and it looks bad and I just don't, it, it's upsetting to me. It's really annoying that that is the case, but whatever. Anyway, yeah. So why is it in manual focus? That's great. That's concerning. Um, but yeah, I'm also going to be watching YouTube in the background. So I'm, again, I'm not going to be really talking too much in this video because I don't really have a lot to say. I'm just trying to like get stuff done. Um, but I'll 
check in with you guys throughout the day. I might go to BJ's. <sighs> because I we made and ate all of the sweet Lauren cookies that we got on Saturday. Saturday. So I might make those. Or I might go get those so I can make more because they are so good. I'm obsessed and I need more. But yeah, let's go ahead and get this day rolling because I'm hungry. I need some coffee. <laughs> pillows yesterday from Target and this is the first one this one came from Lowe's and then over here we have the one that I got from Target yesterday which is so cute I love this and then we have gifts that we have to wrap these are actually like fake boxes just to kind of hide the bottom of the tree because I didn't want to get a tree skirt um, that's for my mom that's my iMac box, and yeah, Christmas tree is so cute. I don't know if we're going to do a topper. I don't really care, um, but I actually still have to fluff out the back of the Christmas tree, but this is how full it looks without having even done that, so that's pretty impressive. other table like this one but it goes in the other guest room um, we need a new piece basically so Josh is trying to have a seller from Amazon squeaky honey don't do that have the seller from Amazon um, send us a new piece so we can put that table together and be done with that but he was asking for pictures and blah, blah, blah. So I had to go take pictures since Josh was at work. And hopefully they will just send us the piece and this will not be a big deal. But it probably will because everything is. <laughs>
um, still humid outside, but it's drier than normal. And my nose is driving me crazy. So if you see me scratching my nose a lot today, sorry, truly, because I know it's not like the cutest movement somebody could do, but like, I literally don't have a choice. And also don't come for me on how I'm doing my makeup because I'm just doing it because I'm filming. Like, I don't want you to have to see me looking crusty every single day, only some days. And so I'm just gonna put on a little bit of makeup down here on my chin and like try to fix the spots that take forever, literally like my whole freaking life to go away. So, I'm doing it for you, and yeah, don't complain about it. I'm doing it for your eyes. So you don't have to see me looking crusty, dusty, and musty every second of the day. You know? I already made my coffee, as you saw. And then, mm -mm -mm. that's dark. I already made my coffee as you saw and now I'm just gonna do this put on a little bit of mascara peanut no put on a little bit of mascara and then I'm gonna go down drink my coffee make breakfast and sadly get this day started because all I want to do is like take a big fat nap I don't want to do anything right now except take the fat nap and then I'm going to have to stop filming earlier than I would normally because I have to get this video up today. Vlogmas is fun, but like not really. <laughs> it's a lot of work and it's a lot of like planning and there's just not enough hours in the day. And you're really only getting half of the day because I have to spend the other half of the day uploading, editing, and doing all that stuff. So I am enjoying Vlogmas, but I'm really excited to go back to a normal filming schedule of once a week. So I saw this thing on TikTok about topical magnesium spray and how it's like was really helping people. They were just like putting it on their feet, whatever. So I bought it from Walmart and this is the one that I have. I don't know like if there's good brands, bad brands. So I don't know if there's good, bad, whatever, but I know people are like picky with their brands. I don't know if this is good or bad, but honestly, it's worked for me. It, I mean, like worked for me. I don't know. I feel like it's fine. I don't know, but that's all I'm saying is I don't know if there's good or bad brands. I just know that that's the brand that I got. I know there's a million different brands. I saw it on TikTok and people said that it was doing wonders for them. I have digestive issues. So for me, if there's something out there that could possibly help with digestion, I'm definitely going to try it because I'm suffering all the time. So hopefully, fingers crossed, it will work. I don't know if I've really noticed a change since I started using it. It's been like a little over a week now. I put it on my feet at night and then sometimes I'll like rub it into my body, but I definitely wouldn't use it after shaving because it kind of burns. It's very concentrated. Um, but yeah, so I, I take magnesium typically anyway. I'm not right now, but I typically take magnesium anyway for headaches. So um, maybe it would help with that if you like have that issue. I don't know. People said it was good for digestion, so that is what I've been using it for. Um, <laughs> so if it ends up but however it ends up working out, I will let you guys know, assuming I even notice a difference. So I actually decided I'm going to have a chocolate chip muffin for breakfast. Um, I might, I'll probably just do like the heat up pizza in the air fryer for lunch. I was going to do it for breakfast, but then I remembered I have muffins. So I'm going to have a muffin. Um, it's kind of lighter anyway. I'm going to finish with my coffee and watch a little bit of YouTube.
Josh's mom gets us a live wreath for Christmas every year and obviously today is December 11th so it's like later than normal but that's because it just got delayed we don't know why but she showed me a few different options and stuff and we like talked about what would look good with the color scheme blah blah, blah. so I'm excited to open it and see which one she ended up picking so it's kind of like a little surprise it's a living wreath it's like it's alive and this will probably actually last us it lasted us through March last year or well you know this year but we got last year and um, that's when we got it like right after Thanksgiving so I bet we'll have this one through April and then since we have it for so long I have another wreath that I use after this one dies and it's like my springy summery wreath because we have this for so long I can already smell it goodness it's like what that is amazing holy cow holy cow oh my goodness I'm like so excited I don't even want to touch it oh it's perfect it's literally perfect It also comes with a hook, but now I have my now my cat's in the box. Oh my goodness, it's literally gorgeous, and I I what how is it so I they do an amazing job. It's a really great gift idea, actually. What? It's like cold because it's been it's alive, so. Literally what this is so pretty. Oh my goodness. I Don't even want to touch it. I don't want to disturb it It's gonna leave little pine needles all over my house <laughs> It's gorgeous. So who cares? I Don't even want to disturb it. Oh my goodness It's wet too again because it's alive Okay my cat is like horrified by this, I guess. I don't know why. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. So, I think we'll go ahead and put the hook on the door. And then I'm not going to show it to you guys until it's hanging up just because I don't want to drop it or like create any more of a mess. But these are real pine cones on it. Everything is real. Obviously the little cranberries aren't real, but the pine cones are real. The wreath is real. What? Literally gorgeous. Obsessed. Literally, this is amazing. There he is. Oh my goodness, okay. So this is what I want to do with my hair. I'm getting my hair done. Um, in a 
a couple months. I haven't gotten my hair done in a long time because so I didn't know what I wanted to do, but I've decided that this is the hair that I'm going to be going for. I'm going to be getting it done in February, January or February. I'm not, I don't, I don't know yet, but it'll depend on like availability and when I can do it. But yeah, I'm like obsessed. That's so pretty. And also I'm going to get extensions because I do want to have more length. My hair is about this long, if not longer right now, but I'm, it's so pretty. I'm only going to get it done once. I don't get my hair done more than once in a year. So, um, since I don't get it done more than once in a year, that will be the hair that I have all throughout 2024 or like the remainder of 2024. So with that being said, I'm like, I want to be sure that what I'm doing is like, something that I'm gonna like long term because I'm gonna have it for like 10 months out of the year and then I won't be getting my hair done until 2025 so I think that one would be easy and fun and because I have naturally dark hair anyway once it starts to grow out it won't look completely ridiculous if I already have dark roots and that's important I don't I'm not gonna touch it up I'm not gonna get my roots done I will get a keratin treatment um every six weeks just because that is really good for my hair specifically um i have naturally i used to have naturally really 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 curly curly girl hair uh but as i've gotten older it's like just boring wavy hair so um yeah and then another thing is i don't want to kill off all my hair so i don't want to have to go and get my hair done every six weeks or something like that only thing i'm going to be doing is my keratin treatment and obviously maintaining my extensions because i will have to get those maintained um another thing is i do wash my hair very frequently i know a lot of people say don't wash your hair every single day but it definitely depends on your hair type for me my hair i haven't washed my hair in a few days because i haven't worked out since wednesday so december 7th i haven't worked out since december 7th and my hair is like dry and gross and not good. It's not good. My hair gets really dry anyway very easily, but it's worse now because I haven't showered. Even putting stuff in it, it doesn't matter. So that's one reason why I'm always washing my hair every single day. Another reason is because, I mean, I don't wash my hair if I don't get sweaty, if I don't need to wash my hair, just because I don't wanna wash it every single day. But I do have to wash my hair basically every day, especially if I get sweaty. I'm, I don't know how you guys go to bed with dirty hair. Um, like, you were sweating and then you're like, this is fine, I'm going to go to bed. I don't understand that. I'm not doing that ever for any reason. So, if I sweat during my workout, which 99% of the time I do, I'm washing my hair before I go to bed. I'm also not a morning shower girly. I'm a night shower girly. So, if... I will be, um, actually I will be a morning and night shower girly here in a hot minute because once I start working at my new job, it's going to be 10 to 6. So Josh will be getting home around the time that I'm done working. <sighs> so I'll have dinner ready by the time he gets home. But I will be waking up early every day to work out and then... I don't have to worry about that like, later in the day. So I'll be working out and then, you know, showering, washing my hair, showering, unless I want to wash my hair at night. But honestly, I think I'll probably wash my hair in the morning because then I have the day for it to like dry and then I can style it if I want to. But yeah, so. <sighs> I'm working on adding some stuff to my calendar or my planner specifically I need to find out where the heck literally where the heck my highlighters are because that is kind of a big part of what I'm doing I might have to go to the mailbox and see if they're there they're not just says arriving today by 10 p.m. let's see if they're 10 stops away yet I live 
so close, less than a mile away from the Amazon warehouse. So it's very easy for me to, I typically get myself really quickly because of that. Uh, but this actually took a while, so I'm guessing it came from somewhere else. But, well, that sucks. I'm really into, like, planners and, like, book kind of things like that. Like, they have Bible tabs, which would have been really helpful for me at one point. But I love when they come out with stuff, like, a long after the fact. If you don't know, I went to a private Catholic school. Uh, you probably don't know that now that I say that, but that would have been really helpful for me for like studying purposes because obviously we take a lot of religious based classes um, in college. By the way, it wasn't I went to a public school growing up, but I went to a private Catholic college, so that would have been great. Also, just for anything like the kind of tabs that I'm looking at look like they would be really helpful for. interesting just like chat gpt it's so funny because at my job we use chat gpt um for different things and i reference it often almost really to kind of confirm what i'm already thinking and it's just so funny because i would have died to have chat 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 gpt goodness gracious growing up would have saved my life i would have been I would have passed my math classes with flying colors. I would not have cried. Actually crazy. that I need to break down before I can put them in my recycling. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to go back inside because I'm really cold. <laughs> Finish my coffee. Work on my planner. And then I'm going to go start painting. Yeah! <laughs>
but as I was standing over here right by the window, of course, Amazon dropped off another package and I'm hoping it's my highlighters because I don't know what else would be coming. So yeah. Oh boy. I don't know what this is. I said I hope it's my highlighters, but honestly, this seems like a really big box for highlighters, so I don't know, to be honest. I'm not sure. So, let's see. It's definitely addressed to me. It's just like a weird packaging. Oh! <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, so it's not even I don't read apparently. Okay, so that's still super exciting. So it's from Nike. This is actually my mom's Christmas present. I'm gonna show you because I can't take the other one out because it's kind of like wrapped in there nicely. Oh, I guess I can. I'll just take both out, it's fine. It's my mom, she won't mind. And this is one of the gifts that I got her. They're like just really light, which is so good because I was honestly kind of concerned that they wouldn't be very light, but they are, so it's fine. Uh, I don't know where to put you. Where are you gonna? Can I trust you? I don't really trust you, so I don't know. Okay. So they're really light um shoes because i've mentioned it a million times my mom had knee surgery she's getting another one so it was important that if i was going to get her shoes they be shoes that she would be able to comfortably wear that weren't really heavy that wouldn't weigh her down um like it was basically walking around without shoes on so that was my goal by getting these i like them for her i do this I'm worried about because I know she doesn't like obvious logos and I know she doesn't like black on her shoes. She has very similar shoes, but that Nike emblem is white. It's not black. But they're not made for anything other than like exercising at home, walking around the neighborhood, whatever. So I think they'll be fine. She has black t-shirts. It's not like she can't match. Um, but yeah, so I'm super excited to get this on. I can't wait. She's going to be so surprised. They were on sale too. And I'm a Nike member, so I got an extra 25% off. So they ended up being so affordable. I'm so happy. I'm very jealous, but I don't run. These are running shoes. Um, I don't run because I don't hate my knees. That's actually why my mom has bad knees is because she used to run a million miles a day when she was younger. So I don't do any high impact at all. No jumping, no jump rope, no running, nothing. So I'm really excited. I think she's gonna really like them. I'm gonna keep them in the box and I'm just gonna put it in a bag um, or wrap it or something. I probably won't wrap it because wrapping is not my forte. But yeah, I'm really happy. I can't wait to give these to her. She's gonna love them. Yeah, now I just need my highlighters. <laughs>
I've just been working on my planner for hours. It's already 4.29, so it's 4.30, and I still have a bunch of stuff that I have to do. I haven't even started painting yet, um, but I do need to make some very, very late lunch because my stomach was just growling a second ago, so I need to eat. I'm gonna put pizza in the air fryer, and then I'm in September of my planner. I just still have so much more to do. I could wait, I could do it later, but I really, really, really want to get it done because I'm going to end up buying another planner for the same thing in a few months when everything changes, but like my OCD is not going to, it's not going to allow this to, <sighs> I have to do it. I have to. So I'm going to make some lunch because I'm hungry and then go upstairs and paint. Um, I haven't worked out in four days. Oh, when I feel it, I miss working out. So I have to work out tonight. I've got a lot of making up to do, but in the meantime, um, I need to finish this and paint. Also, I didn't take anything out for dinner. So that means we are having burgers, frozen burgers, because I don't know what to tell you. Didn't take anything out for dinner. Josh didn't take anything out for dinner. We totally forgot. So, burgers it is. All right, it's about 5.30. A little after 5.30 now. I'm gonna walk my dog. Um, and then I'm going to, I'm gonna wait for Josh to get home before I like start the burgers. But um, yeah, I'm gonna walk my dog. Come on, Peanut. And I'm in November, I think now for my calendar, so I'm almost done. But honestly, it, I feel like I haven't done anything today, which sucks, but 